What's good, y'all? What's good? I just got back from the gym, man. We checking in for another video. I'm over here at Joe Buddy Racing. As y'all can see, behind me, it's raining again, man. Well, I said, man, I want to get y'all some action content, but it's raining, man. This rain just non-stop. So, I said, we finna go ahead and check on the motor. This is an official um, box Chevy budget bill episode because I, I picked up some too, uh, which I got to leave here and then go get it. Y'all see what I picked up for the box. So, we about to slide ahead and see what's going on. All right, so I'm inside the shop, man. I want to throw this nice piece right here on the camera. I can't remember the username, but actually one of the YouTube supporters, man. I appreciate them big time, too. Uh, I know Aunt appreciate them. Uh, Aunt doing some work to this thing. We ain't going to the front because you got you know, you know, to respect everybody. I don't know if he want the, want the uh, motor on camera. I said, he, uh, I can't remember your username. He come in, you come in on the video too, but yeah, this is his Mustang. Say, so they one of the supporters, man. So when he come in, y'all showing love, like. So I want to just, anytime a supporter, a subscriber, anybody come down here, I try to get him on camera, put him in the vlog. So I ain't for sure that him, huh? Got the I'm not for sure this is him. Nah, I, I, he, he come in. I can't remember his username. Uh, so I don't think it's him. He he just got this car started on it. He just got the car. Yeah. Nah, it, it, it's one of the subscribers. Oh, he come in. He come in. He said, "Uh, I can't comment below on this video. Whenever you see it, cause you come in on one of the other video. I just can't remember your YouTube name." Yeah, I don't. Well, I, I, I'm saying I ain't for sure this is him. That's the I, name. I think this was already on the car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, I don't okay. think this is username. But uh, but yeah. So far, we, so far we we changed some stuff on it. You gonna you gonna be it gonna be on your channel too, ain't it? Uh? Yeah, but you can show this so far. He said he cool, he cool with it? Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah, y'all. I, I told you I respect all y'all, so I ain't know if you want to own. So, so, so we took off this monstrosity. Well, hold on. What we gonna do, cause it actually, um, Bill, I'm just showing y'all the car, so he he finna vlog and everything, so y'all gonna check that out on his channel. He gonna tell you what he got going on with it, but this it. I just want to show it on my channel, but make sure to go over to Joe Buddy Racing and uh, check the video out, the stuff he's doing to it. So I'm gonna check back in with y'all. All right, so. We got an engine update y'all look at that y'all know last time last time uh these went in here so yes sir we uh uncle came in and pulled one of those late nights and got got the bottom end together so before long i got a surprise with this bad boy too i got a surprise that's why i said y'all stay tuned in all next week Y'all stay tuned in. Cause I'm pretty sure by the end of next week, y'all gonna see this whole thing complete and together and all of that. But look, I need, we got, like I said, flat top, four eyebrow relief. Motor probably gonna be with the heads that's gonna be on it. And depending on the thickness of a head gasket, cause that affects your compression too for people that don't know. Probably gonna be 10 to 1 uh, somewhere up in there. Still to run 93 octane, but yeah. Yes, indeed, man. We got the crank in there, the crankshaft in there. So this is a 60 over. It's a 350. It's 60 over. 60 over make it 360 cubic inches. So if you don't know, if you got a 350 board 30 over with a standard stroke crank, 3.48 stroke crank, that'll make it three, uh, 355 if it's 30 over 350. A 40 over 350 is a 357. And mine's, which is a 60 over with a standard 3.48 stroke crank, is a 360 cubic inch and i know some people be talking about man you might see back in the day they used to say they are overheat these do not overheat man 60 over got still got pretty thick walls and all that you know the cylinder still pretty thick i done ran two of these 60 over and never had no problem never had no problem over, uh, with heating or cooling or whatever so yeah we got that i want to update y'all on the engine like i said i got some more parts coming Probably get Uncle here too. Y'all to talk about it. But look, I want y'all, I want y'all opinion, honestly. Cause I'm running AC now. But I'm thinking about he y'all see he got uh he got the cutlass together. Well he got the motor in there. Like I said, he was in front of me. Uh it's his cousin. He got his small block in there. I know it's a little dark, all the lights ain't on. But should I get this? Should I run the one belt stuff, the GM one belt stuff? One belt stuff pretty straight, you know, running a serpentine belt. Should I run that or run the V belts? I know some people in the comment might be like the V belt gonna come off and this and that. It didn't ever throw the belt in my truck. But reason I asked because I still got the motor that came out my S10 right there. And I got all the billet 
the billet pulleys and brackets and stuff. So that's what I'm saying. Should I run that stuff and just go and buy my own um, power stern brackets like that? You know, make it all billet by the power stern brackets and the billet AC or uh, brackets for the compressor or just run the one belt stuff. So put in the comments what y'all think. But yeah, this it. So you got the short block together. Cam in. He probably lubricating the on uh, lifters. They probably soaking. Then you drop the lifters in there. Then when they top in on there, boy, hey, I can tell y'all this. This motor is gonna be beautiful. Straight up, my motor be nice. So if you remember the motor in my truck, hey, that that bad boy was nice. So stay tuned next week. Now I'm telling you, next week, next week we going to work. But let me get on some light, man. This it's too dark in here, boy. I look like I'm in Death Valley or something. Hey. Two dog, but all right. Anyway, but next week we going to work, man. I'm telling you, the motor gonna get complete. Um, what else? I'm about to be painting up under the hood, uh, the engine bay of the uh of the box. Gonna be changing the tires over and stuff, man. My Pete Lady Tanks, supposed to, we supposed to link up. She's supposed to go to work, turn some wrenches and all that. Uh, we're gonna be changing the tires over. Cause if you saw my other vlog, you know I got the locks off. Uh, we going to Summit. I'm telling y'all, man. I'm going to Summit. I'm gonna drop the bag. I'm dropping the bag on Summit. I'm going to AutoZone, Holly Wheel. I got to get a whole lot of stuff. It's about to be a whole lot of parts coming. Uh, Camaro parts coming. I'm telling y'all, I'm about to go in. It's crunch time. Hey, race season. Race season never ends in in the South. Well, I'm in Georgia. Race season never ends. But officially, March is gonna be going down. So I'm gonna be having to pull the cars out. I plan on debuting the big rim box at Shut Up and Race, March the uh, 21st at Headhunters Dragway. I'm saying it officially on camera. I've been supporting Mandrell since he first started. He's been supporting me from the beginning. So that's why I'm going to debut the big rim car. Uh, I'm not going to run that car on the track all the time. And I'm not going to run it at just anybody event. It's going to be people I really support. Because it's not going to be super fast. It's just going to be for a show. But we're going to put together a little masterpiece. The bottom man, for people wonder, it all stopped. Well, it ain't stopped. <laughs> it's not stopped because it's 60 over, but everything is cast. None of this is forged. None of this is forged by the man. I was trying to keep it budget as possible. Because forged by the men, get the, they get the costume. But you want to run forged pistons and crank and rods, you plan on hitting, hitting the motor with a lot of nitrous. Like 200, 200 shot of up. You want you want to run forward by the man, or if you want to run some boost, turbocharger engine, or pro charger, supercharger, and you really want to turn it up, you better get to a forward by the man. Don't don't cut the, don't cut no corner right there. But mine, I don't plan on doing all that. I'm gonna put a little shot of nitrous on it in the summer, like 150, which you can do that on stock by the men's with the right tune, right timing, right fuel, high high enough octane fuel, and you know. You can get away with it, and it'll live. I done done all this stuff, I'm telling y'all. But, like I said, this is a cast piston, cast rod, cast crank. Nothing special about the bottom end. It has a very nice cam in it. I give y'all the specs on the cam uh, in a little bit. The cost of this motor right here is around three grand. Well, it, it's, <laughs> it, it's really a little more than that, man. It's a little more, but I'm going to have to... Uh, I'm gonna have to do a official price sheet because some people be saying I don't say the prices, which I throw them out there here and there. But I do the price breakdown of my bills after I um, complete it. That's when I do a official breakdown of everything, the cost of what it takes. So just stay tuned in because, like I said in this vlog, I did buy some for the box. I did buy some stuff, I should say, for the box, and I gotta go pick it up. So uh, that's gonna be in this video too, and we're gonna talk about all that. So I right, tune back in. And catch y'all in a few. Man, I gotta put this on my vlog, man. My buddy Tim, this my buddy right here now. He ain't never been on the vlog. Tim, yeah. Tim about to get some stuff done to the truck. Hey, who who influenced you to get up, make all these changes? Hey, right there, you already looking at it. You looking at it. <laughs> that man told me I didn't put a big enough cam in here. No. So I'm just I'm gonna put hey, one in. Hey, Tim, uh, only yeah. thing will happen. He telling me what I need, what he want to do. Right, so right. I'm just, I'm just a sponsor. I'm just paying. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey man, you know? it was like that, man. It was, <laughs> he told me what he wanted to do. I built it. Then he went out to the country, to the street race, and came back. Now he need a monster. 
<laughs> so that's what I'm gonna be for a month. Hey, I, told him, I said, yeah, that really happened, but hey, I said, don't boy fast. He said, well, we got to get him. And so, and I should have been listening to him. And then where we at now, look, Tim yeah. about to go cash out, y'all. Like, hey, let me tell y'all something about Tim, too, boy. If he say he gonna do it, he gonna do it now. Hey, boy, he finna cash out, so. Okay. The, yeah, look, that's the owner. Of the white salt bed. Y'all done seen it in my vlog. The ghost. What it called? The ghost. The ghost. That's the owner. Tell the owner of the white salt bed. Y'all be seeing in the video. Well, uh, Unk be burning all his ties off. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, hey, hey y'all seen the ghost on my last video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unk, and every time y'all see it on his vlog, too, what he doing? He's spinning the ties, ain't he? <laughs> hey, tell me. Tell me. Tell me if it needed some more motor or uh, some more cash. Oh yeah, drop in the comments drop on my vlog. Y'all tell me what y'all think about uh, Tim Truck. Do it need some more cam in and all that? Uh, what, what should Tim do? And he gonna read the comment, y'all. He took out the video too, so y'all uh, drop in the comment below. But yeah, I just want to get that on, on camera call. Man, we were tripping out over here, man. They, they had me dying last, so I want to uh, put that in the vlog for y'all. But I'm gonna catch y'all in a minute. Alright, y'all. So look, we over here. Uh, what the plans for next week? I told them we shouldn't be on the box next week. Next week, we're gonna finish it. The engine, put it all together. Um, then we're gonna bring the box up, gonna dress it under the hood, paint it all, and uh, get all our, our parts together. Then we're gonna set it in there and try to get it up and running so we'll be closer to our target. Um, it shouldn't, I, I guess, take a couple of days, right? Right, that's what I tell them too. I'll get it done, but. It shouldn't take us very long. Hey, look, why? Well, well, I got you on camera, cause you know we're going on Dino with it too. What you think? What you think? A little combination right here gonna make? I told him we budget now. Yeah, it, it probably it's it's probably gonna make mm, three seventy five. Yeah, that's what I think it's all. And it's a little budget combination. It's three three sixty yeah. cubic inch motor. So yeah, y'all look. <clears throat> oh, you came here pull one the night, then you look. You popped up. Yeah. They saw. <laughs> yeah. I told you how I do it. I come here. <laughs> I get it. I get it going. And y'all notice that right there was on the stand. It's in the car now, as I showed y'all earlier. Yeah, we, we, over here we got valve cover, the belt, radiator. Put the headers on. Start the time. We it's, it's time. To, it's time to ride in this thing. Yeah, hitting that video. He been shooting the video day, so uh, he got that coming. I'm I'm gonna check it out soon. He get the edit done and all that. So he got a video coming on that car. Thank you for the work on it now. Some more, but. Yeah, I've been trying to finish this off right here. Yeah, so while I got him over there, I'll just let him update y'all on what we're going to have going on next week. But, uh, man, hopefully, I, I suppose it. I said, I got, I bought some more parts for the um box. But I don't know if I'm going to be able to pick them up today. So, if I can't, you know, I'll just get with y'all and close the vlog out. Just showing y'all the motor and all that. But stay tuned in for next week, for real, because we're going to have a whole lot going on over here. So, um. Like maybe the next clip I had a part, but if I don't, I'll be closing the video out, so I'll catch y'all in a minute. Alright y'all, so while y'all over, while we over here, people that might have missed some of the episode, show y'all some of my part pile. <clears throat> Again, so this is the carburetor going on this thing. It's a 6, no, 750, my bad. 750 is actually a vacuum secondary carburetor. Like I said, I ain't trying to race race, so it do the job. Otherwise, you know, you double double pumping and stuff. So we got that. I got valve covers and headers and stuff too. Let me see. <clears throat> I think they'll put it. Oh, there go the headers. Got the headers right there. <clears throat> the flow tech headers. The valve covers. I showed y'all the valve covers and all that. The valve covers over there. I think that's the valve covers. And them valve covers is the move. Let me see. Nope, that ain't them. <clears throat> I got a lot of parts, y'all. I can't remember. But I got the valve covers too. Like I said, it's back in secondary carburetor. You want to see the part number? There it is right there. <clears throat> the carburetor was 400 something. 400 something dollars, I think. The valve covers are. <clears throat> the headers were like two some, two eighty. If I remember right. I give y'all the exact price. Like I said, I give y'all a full price breakdown at the end of the build and all that. And uh, like I got the aluminum, <clears throat> I got the aluminum well valve covers and stuff. So they gonna make the engine look real, real good. 
And uh, yeah. But I'ma catch y'all in a few. All right, y'all. So checking back in. Um, finna close the video out, cause ain't nothing else going on pretty much. Like I said, I I gonna try to go get the parts. But I go ahead and tell y'all what I got. Um, I went ahead and bought a system. Well, I gotta get a box. I bought two 15s and I got a 3,000 watt amp. The 15s, 1,800 watts a piece max. Uh, I show y'all the speakers and stuff. I actually bought them from my cousin. Uh, little crazy whips addiction. So he cut me a good deal on the $200. Trying to tell y'all the price, y'all. You saying I'm gonna be saying prices, man. But like I said, complete price breakdown as soon as the car fire up. But uh, when y'all say it in the comments, get a system. I start hunting down a system all off top, kept it budget. It's an amazing deal for for the stuff he gave me. So I thought I was gonna get with him today and pick that up, but I can't. I can't get him and get him on the phone today. Whatever he probably tied up. So the next vlog, I should have that stuff and I show y'all what I got and all that. Got a huge magnet on. It. So they should they should get down and all that. I actually got an end dash too. A buddy of mine, he he working on a uh, turbo Camaro too. He got an F body just like mine, my boy Corey. So Corey, you see this, man, I appreciate it. I put a post up on my Facebook. Corey said he'll let me have it. He got an end dash uh, TV. He gonna let me have so that's love, man. You know, you be good to people, people look out for you. So I literally got a complete system. All I gotta do is find the box for the 15s. I need uh Ported, I want a ported box. I need a ported box for the 15s. Need to have some good airspace. So if any of y'all got something, y'all in Georgia or you know somebody got something, you can look out for them and hook me up, whatever. Put in the comments and I get with you or something. We might make that happen. So got the system. Uh, I got to get the wire kit and all that stuff. Got the system and all that. I'm gonna begin four six by nines, uh, two six and a halves. Cause I'm a, I'm getting I'm getting some hooked up. I say that. So I'm need two six and a half, and uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have a system for the box. Uh, but yeah, this little update, y'all saw the engine right here. Um, next week it's gonna be a lot of box Chevy content, and it's gonna be some Camaro content too. Cause basically we're gonna be messing with both of the cars. It's gonna it's gonna go down next week, and uh, it's gonna be action week all over just for everybody. Cause I'm gonna be uh taking. Uh, baby out the street car y'all definitely gonna want to see his vlog cause boy y'all gonna want to see his that video probably gonna go crazy I can't wait to see it either but yeah y'all just tune in next week tune in to the whole crew everybody's channel just tune in cause it's gonna be straight action going down uh, my peep like I said Lady Tank she probably gonna come and link up with her she gonna help me change the tires on the box uh just like I said, just tune into the whole crew. Everybody that I'm affiliated with, they like my fam. Y'all tune in to everybody channel. Gonna be a lot of action. All I can say. Uh, but yeah, this is it. Hope y'all enjoyed this video, man. Next week should be sunny too, so y'all should see some action out of all of us. And uh, I'll catch y'all next time. I'm out.